Adventures in Pixie Land presents your daily energy reading. Today's daily astrology reading for December 23rd, 2023 is the waxing gibbous moody moon in steadfast Taurus. Messenger Mercury retrograde spins back into dynamic Sagittarius. Be careful to make sure that you are not selfish, lazy, aggressive, or excessive. We need to be big picture and fine details. Remain in balance. Today's Elder Futhark Daily Rune for December 23rd, 2023 is Manaz. Manaz, the letter M, the meaning humanity, mankind, association, awareness, the self, knowledge, collective consciousness of humanity. Today, your focus is on your understanding of self and what you bring to the rest of humanity. Everyone's gifts are unique. All people have value. Make sure you place value on yourself as well as others. Today is a daily romance angel oracle card for December 23rd, 2023 is soulmate. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. You chose this card because you wonder if a certain person is your soulmate and the answer is yes. As we all do, you have many soulmates, beings with whom you have shared a mystical soul connection and life path. Soulmates incarnate with a plan of coming together for mutual spiritual and personal growth. As you suspected, the person you're inquiring about is one of yours. That sense of familiarity and comfort you felt when you first met also indicates your soulmate bond. This card sometimes comes to ask, well, comes to those who ask, when will I meet my soulmate? Or will I ever meet my soulmate? As validation that this will occur. Many times this person is whom you already know. Although romantic sparks didn't fly at first, you'll have another opportunity to explore passions together. Today's Daily Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for December 23rd, 2023 is Attitude. Attitude. Keyword? Well attitude. Make faces at yourself in the mirror today. If you have drawn the attitude card, you can be sure that there is a message here for you. Take a close look at the way you interact with others. Stand up for your rights and your ideals, but also honor other people's positions. What appears obvious to you may not be obvious to another person. Go deep within yourself and ask, what is it that I need to observe within myself? We can choose to act or react to any situation. Do you fly off the handle when confronted with a difficult lesson? Or do you take a deep breath, center yourself, and consider what would be the best course of action? It is important to listen to the inner voice that knows that spirit wants what's best for you. Just ask yourself for help. And remember that every problem comes with its own solution. Your own inner self will be glad to whisper the solution to you. Sometimes, It comes in words or thoughts of insight. Other times it comes as a message that urges you to have faith that the universe is moving energy around. 
in order to manifest that perfect outcome. This is an exercise in trust and faith. Listen to all that you say and think all day long. Whenever a negative or judgmental thought comes in, immediately replace it with a positive one. Remember, what you focus on is what you attract into your life. So carefully choose what kind of life you want. The simple act of placing a smile on your face generates a chemical change within your body that brings about happier feelings. Others will also react to the way that reflects on how you present yourself to them. Remember to avoid judgments of yourself, others, or situations. Gather the facts. Ask for divine help. Then listen for the next course of action. Your chant, Mother, Father, God, help me to see what I need to see and to release what I need to release. Help me to see within the mirror clearly and with the insight into my inner being. Assist me in being forgiving of myself and others so that I may live the happiest and most successful life possible. So be it. Today's daily starseed oracle card for December 23rd, 2023 is Blue Flame. The Blue Flame. Spontaneous awakening. Activation. Integration time. This is a card of awakening and energetic upgrades. Perhaps you've been going through a period of spontaneous awakening, receiving visions and having experiences that are out of the ordinary. In the West, little is known about the process of spontaneous awakening. It can feel very scary when you're going through it alone. Elsewhere, it can be seen as an auspicious experience with those going through them being treated with tender care. The blue beings are thought to be activating beings with great potential for healing and upgrading our cellular structures. They appear in moments of extreme awakening, activating a physical kundalini awakening and deep cellular and DNA healing. Many people glamorize the awakening process. However, in reality, it's much messier and more difficult than most of us believe. We must first let go of what we think we know for sure and make sense and how we make sense of the world. And this isn't easy. The awakening process, even when it's spontaneous, takes a considerable amount of time to integrate. An awakening without integration can leave us feeling very ungrounded. If you're in the midst of awakening and the process never ends, treat this time as deeply sacred and give yourself ample space to ground and integrate the extreme changes you're going through. Your starseed activation, place your hand on the portal of your heart and whisper the following. I allow myself to surrender to the awakening process that's right for me. I take things slowly and integrate my experience each and every day. Today's Daily Priestess of Light Oracle card for December 23rd, 2023 is Angelic Assistance. Angelic Assistance Keywords, divine guidance, loving support. This tender-hearted, smiling angel brings you a message of encouragement and support. 
Heavenly light emanates from her heart and hands, and the brilliance of divine consciousness shines down from above the top of her head. This vibrating resonance of healing and loving power is all around you, brought by the angels who long to assist you in every area of your life. If you have never turned to the angels before, now is the time to start. They are a very real presence in the world, and they can exert a significant influence on your life. If you have a problem that needs resolving, or a project that needs some inspiration, the angels can help you there. Whether you're working on a physical issue or a difficult relationship, the angels bring clarity and healing. So stop resisting and open up to their very real power. Invite them to walk with you through your day. Ask for their guidance, energy, and joyous resolutions. Then let yourself stop and take a moment to receive. You'll be amazed by the healing, peace, and inspiration that comes your way. Your affirmation? My life is filled with angelic power. I ask for their assistance and open up to their healing love. The daily energy reading for December 23rd, 2023 is the astrology is telling you to remain in balance and don't get aggressive or lazy in your communication with others. Manaz says that you need to remember we are all children of creator. The romance oracle wants you to know, yup, this is a soulmate. You're correct. The fairies remind you that you never get positive results from a negative attitude. The star seed oracle reminds you to surrender to the divine. The priestess of light oracle says, um, yep, I did send you in some backup. Make sure you say thank you. So it appears that there might be some people around you, perhaps a soulmate, Maybe it's you, maybe it's them, maybe it's both of you. Hard to say. Somebody's got a piss poor attitude. Somebody is not really interested in doing the work that they need to do. They're not really interested in surrendering to the divine. And uh, it, they don't seem to notice you, them, otherwise, the angelic assistance that's coming in. If you're the one dealing with this person, then the angelic assistance is there for you to remind you that we are all children of the creator. And you responding to their aggression with more aggression will solve nothing. Don't be lazy and don't play tit for tat attitude. On the other hand, if you're the one with the piss poor attitude, not willing to do the work, not willing to surrender to the divine, and you feel like you're a giant child ready to throw a temper tantrum, then the angels are there for the assistance of the people who unfortunately have to deal with you in your very immature attitude. Which you can obviously tell, I would think from my tone, how spirit feels about that. Yes, life can get frustrating. Yes, it's easy to fall into that swirl of negative thinking. But you're not going to manifest anything positive from that place. It's your job to keep you in balance. It's always your job to keep your temper in check. And it's always your job to be properly communicating with everybody, including spirit. So if somebody is making you upset with their attitude or if you just woke up on the wrong side of the bed today, well then, go recenter yourself, make your apologies, and get yourself back into the positive mindset so you can actually manifest the things you want. <laughs>